everyone, it's me, Sharon, of Creative Glam and Crafts. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today I'm going to share with you how I created this card using the Lawn Fawn die cut called the Quilted Backdrop. I thought it was an absolutely beautiful die cut. It's very detailed, as you can see. Uh, it's got the little, uh, the four petals that intersect with um, a grid of stitches. And I just thought that was so pretty. I love that you can see, you can just see through to the back side of the die. Now this is not a new die cut at all by Lawn Fawn. My understanding is that this die came out about a year ago, but it's new to me. I just received it in the mail, so I'm gonna share with you how I created this card. I'm also gonna be featuring the Hero Arts stamp. And I got this stamp from Joanne Crafts and it was on sale for five dollars and I thought that was a really good price. I thought that was the cutest little dog so I will be using my Copic markers today to color that in. And I'll be using the stitched rectangles by Elizabeth Crafts. So let's get started. I've got my card base is four by five and a half. I've also got a mat that's also four by five and a half. As you saw earlier, I cut out the quilted backdrop die. This is what it actually looks like. And I thought that was so pretty how it comes through. And I've also die cut a frame using my Elizabeth Craft stitched rectangles. So let's put this card together. The first thing I'm going to do is stamp my sentiments. I'm going to be using my Versamark ink and my um, Tim Holtz clear emboss embossing powder. And I'm going to heat emboss my sentiments. And then I'll die cut them out. It's going to say heartfelt thanks from our family to yours. I'm actually making this card for the pet sitter who takes such awesome care of Major during the day.
I've got everything fluffy cut out. I like how this card turned out. If you enjoyed it too, let me know. Leave me a comment down below. I appreciate you being here, and I would love it if you gave me a thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below, along with the notification bell. Hit the notification bell twice, so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. I have other videos linked down in the description box. Be sure and check them out too. And with that being said, have a blessed day, and I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam and crafts. Bye!